they spawn the, uh, I still can't think of it, the smaller ships, yeah. Oh, and by the way, hey guys, and then Game 10 Master Doe here. I checked you guys, didn't you? You thought I was doing one take only. Well, uh, yeah, that t last video was, I did it yesterday, so, uh, now it's this video. Now that I deal with the battleships, I'm going back upstairs to try and find the missing, um, the target that I missed, so yeah. There's a round ring in the middle that I didn't show, but uh, if you can get there and do a little bit of third person platforming, then you can actually, um, you can get a lot of weapons that may or may not help you. Personally, the blaster is all I need, and by blaster I mean the pistol that you can charge up, but uh, it's up to you whether you want to use a different weapon or not. Yeah, you can see right there that there was three glowing icon things. Those are two guns and a health pack. I'm not sure which guns there are. I think one's a rocket launcher, I think. But uh, looks like Wolf has just got in. Turns out this is their base. That's why O'Donnell, the name O'Donnell, was familiar to me. Because Wolf's full name is Wolf O'Donnell. So yeah, there's a little piece of trivia for you. Looks like they got a new member, Panther. Wait, where's Pigma? Pigma? Don't know anything about Pigma. But there is one uh, that thing. doesn't answer my question. Or foxes. I'm owed an apology. And I will Whatever. You know what? I have to give Wolf credit. He is one badass villain. I'm serious. He's cool. He's an awesome multiplayer character, and his ship, his spaceship, the Wolfen, is freaking cool looking in Star Fox Assault. In Star Fox 64 it was okay, but in Star Fox Assault, for some odd reason the graphics are pretty good for the GameCube, like I said before. So I'm... it, it, it just amazes me. Anyways, the Wolf Gang is... Still the same as always. I'm just trying to pick up my words. That's why I have long pauses. Oh gosh, we have to help Crystal. Yeah, you're gonna have to help out your teammates once you're in space. Whenever you're in space, you might they might need your help. But uh, the funny thing is, if you're in the base, they won't need your help. Well, come on. There we go. Anyways. For Star Wolf, you're gonna have to. The best solution is to lock on and just shoot them down. That's all that there is to it. If you play Star Fox 64, use exactly the same methods. When they get behind you, do a loop. When they get past you, do a U turn. Oh my gosh, not Falco. Great. I'm gonna have to save his butt. Normal shots are okay if you can shoot them fast, but, uh. In this game, you can't really shoot them that fast. For some odd reason, in this game, you sh press the shoot button during the when you're in the R wing. It only shoots one shot, while in Star Fox 64, it shot three shots every time you shot. You press the A button, so I don't know what's up with that. I just killed you rapid fire, and I saved you already. There we go. That's all I really have to say about the Wolf Gang. They're not really that hard. They were much more difficult in uh, Star Fox 64 since you had a smaller battlefield to face them on. In Star Fox 64, you face them about three times during the 15 missions. It depends on what missions, what planets you took on to face them. You couldn't face all three, you could only face two of them. It's hard to explain, but. This is Star Fox Assault, and I'm not explaining Star Fox 64 right now, so... Oh, and when you're having the fight with Wolf, you don't have to worry about the battleships and all that, so just ignore them. Unless they get annoying, of course. Like here, the battleship's shooting rockets at me. There goes... There goes the Star Wolf team. That was pretty easy. Although I'm kind of ticked off that I had to go back outside because I missed the target, and I had to deal with the battleships. Come on, Wolf. Enough of this. Just yeah, where is Pigma? 
Wow. You know, I really hate Pigma in this series. He betrayed the original Star Fox team. He was an enemy in Star Fox 64, and he betrayed the Star Wolf team. So he's pretty much an, an asshole. Excuse my language for those younger viewers out there, but yeah, he's pretty much of a really big jerk. But uh, just tell us where Pigma is. How can I resist this? Wow. You know, Panther is a new character in Star Fox Assault. He was an okay addition, but uh, I don't think he really has a big backstory. In fact, none of the Star Wolf team has a big backstory. Although I think some of it is explained in Star Fox Command, which I never bought. It looks like a pretty bad game compared to the rest of the Star Fox games. Although I heard it's pretty much like Star Fox 2. But uh, anyways, that's my... There. I'm just thinking up again. Blah. That was yet another part of my Let's Play of Star Fox Assault. Next time we will see where the Star Fox gang is next. I think they're headed towards wherever Pigman is. But uh, yeah, so make sure you guys comment, rate, subscribe, watch my other videos, and I'll see you guys next time.